Welcome back to my channels, Purse Fanatic and Fashion Fanatic, depending on which one you're watching from. If you're interested in all things purses, definitely subscribe to my Purse Fanatic channel below if that's the channel you're watching from. If you're interested in a little bit more fashion hauls in addition to purses, then definitely subscribe to my Fashion Fanatic channel. And if you like both, you can subscribe to both. So anyway, guys, I am here today because I am going to do um, sort of an experiment. Um, so I was checking out the Nordstrom Rack sale. I think it's called Off the Rack or whatever. They had the sale recently, maybe like a few weeks ago. Had a lot of nice items on sale and checking it out. And I happened to run across a purse that looked just like a Chanel purse. I mean, it was just so like, wow, kind of scary because it looks so similar. And the purse was, I think, $55. And it was by um, uh, Badgley Mishka. And I thought to myself, hmm, I'd like to see how it compares to a real Chanel purse. Like, can you get this purse for $55? And it, it's just pretty similar to the Chanel purse. So I already have uh, a Chanel purse myself. I bought it on the uh, resale market. It's a flat bag. Now this one looks like the flat bag. The only difference is it kind of is more similar to the, the reissued Chanel bag that they had before where it didn't have the flap on it. Kind of had that like turn lock. So it's a little bit different. But, you know, they're very uh, similar, very, you know, alike. So I thought to myself, let's see how the two compare. So I'm going to unbox this. I haven't looked at it first. We're going to look at it together. We're going to open the box together to see the purse I purchased. And then I'm going to pull out my extra Chanel purse and we'll do a little comparison. You know, let's see. Maybe I might be, you know, more interested in the other one, the one from Nordstrom. So anyway, let's go ahead and get started. All right, guys. So like I said, $55. I was like, okay. Now, I don't believe this purse is leather though. So that's the only difference. But, you know, a lot of purses nowadays, anyway, they're not making out of leather. People are shying away from using leather. So, if you get one for leather, you know, it's going to be surprising. And usually, if you do get it, it's going to be an arm and a leg. I mean, really, it's going to be very expensive. So, you know, I'm okay with the non-leather purse as long as it's well-made. You know, I prefer leather because it will last longer. It doesn't peel. And you can know... You know, 10 years down the line, it'll be some good. All right, so let's take a look. All right, and this is, they had two colors. I think it was the black they had and they had a blush, which is more like a pink. Hence why I'm wearing pink. Um, the black I didn't get because like I said, the, I already have a Chanel flap and that happens to actually be in a black color. So I said, I don't need two black purses. I didn't need, really, I don't need any more black purses, period. But, um, you should check out my other video on that new Kate Spade crossbody. Um, it's in black. I did not want it, but that bag is the bomb. So you should check out my video on that one. Um, and I think it's still available. The purse is still available. That one I got from Nordstrom during the Nordstrom anniversary sale. Unfortunately, it's still not on sale, um, but you can still get a hold of it. All right, guys, I'm excited. Let's see, let's see. As you can see, it's more the size of the jumbo, which is actually what I do have. I have the jumbo. Like I said, it's by Badgley Mishka. I will link it if it's still available. Um, if it's not, I can't do it, but I will definitely try to link it for you if it's available. All right, so let's go ahead and take this loose here. Let's take a peek. I mean, I'm, I'm seeing it's looking kind of nice here, guys. I don't know. I might have a little winner. I might have a winner. Guys, yeah, they call these dupes. I mean, they're not trying to actually be a Chanel version. It's Badgley Mishka. It looks different from the Chanel, but it's, it has characteristics that are similar. So that's what we call a dupe. Okay? It's not trying to pretend to be Chanel. So I, you know, I would never, you know, be an advocate for that. So, all right. So let's go ahead and take it loose. And I, I just love purses, guys. You know, it, it doesn't matter. It doesn't have to be name brand, it can be name brand, it, you know, it's just, you know, it doesn't have to be designer, it doesn't have to be a million dollars, I don't have to spend a bunch of money, as long as it's a cute purse, I think it's adorable, then I'm getting it, I'm sorry. All right, guys, the reveals. Oh, this is really, really nice, guys, OMG. Okay, can I say, oh, 
OMG. Okay, yes, this, my friend, if you're trying to get you a Chanel and you don't want to spend ten thousand dollars, which I did not spend because, like I said, I purchased mine on the resale market, guys. This is a super alternative. Look how cute and gorgeous this is. This is beautiful. Look at this. Oh, I'm in love. And they have it in black too. I don't need a black. If you want a black, you can get a black. So let's just look at it. Let's look how beautiful it is. So it's got the gold chain. Now I actually have a silver chain on my purse. I could have had the gold, but I, I wound up getting the silver one. That's the one that I was able to find on the resale market. My purse was basically pretty much brand new. Uh, so I couldn't beat it, but it was silver. So I said, oh, well. Um, now look here. Now this is definitely different, right? As we know, they have magnetic snaps on the Chanel bags. Now the reissue looked looks a little bit more like this. Now this one here says Badgley Mishka. You turn it. So this reminds me of the reissue, but it has the flap okay part to it so oh my gosh this is so cute guys this is an adorable bag now look here we got this wonderful pocket oh gorgeous i don't think mine has a pocket i don't think chanel bags have the pocket in there um it has a separation so we know that chanel does not have a separation in the bag they have more like if you get the one uh the newer version with the flap the, the i think um, you get like a little extra piece on here to give the, the uh, bag a little support. So here, and this is what we say it's different from Chanel. They're not trying to be Chanel, but it's a separation. One here, one here. And then of course you have like a little zipper compartment and you can put your phone in there like that. Cause that way you don't have to search for it. So I super love it. Um, let me just take this paper out. Let's see if there's anything else in here. Oh yeah. So it looks like they have some pockets. This is a bigger pocket little pocket of course you wouldn't see that in a chanel bag but that's cute right it's adorable i love it okay i think you have a winner guys i think this is an alternative look at that nice oh my god this is so well made i love this purse okay and on the back another flap now i think some chanel bags have, oh no this is not a flap guys I don't know exactly what this is, but it's not like something you could put something in. It's, it's actually, a, if you look at it, it goes straight through. Like your hand goes through like that. Yeah, so I don't really know what the purpose of that is. Maybe it's just for design. But whatever it is, it's cute. So I don't care. <laughs> All right, I'm going to put the papers back. So let me put on my regular purse. I'm going to put on my regular Chanel. And you tell me. You guys tell me, what do you think? Like, do you think, this, I think this is a great alternative. $55. Now, I don't know that it's going to be $55 now. I don't even know if they're selling it now, but, you know, it can't be as much as, it's not going to be as much as Chanel bag, right? But it looks like one. This is such a cute purse. Um, Yeah, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I love it. This is a keeper. I was looking at getting another Chanel. Was not going to get it. Just looking. Looking. Not getting. Looking at getting it. That's the difference. And I want another color. Hey. I don't need to. I have a turn. Now, guys, I do not believe this is leather. I don't. Oh, yeah, it's vegan leather. So I didn't think it would be. But I know if it was leather, it probably definitely wouldn't be $55. But it looks good. All right, so let's compare to my Chanel flap, okay? Let's see, guys. What are we working with? What is the difference, okay? Okay. So you see, this is mine. And this is the Badge the Mishka. Now look at that. Size-wise, if you're looking for the jumbo, these are pretty similar, guys, in size. Look at that there. If you put it on top of each other, pretty much overlaps. Let's see, put it behind. Yeah, about the same size, guys. I will have to say, if you look, this is jumbo. So if you're looking for a jumbo bag, great. If you're looking for a medium, this is not gonna do it for you. But if you see here, look at that. Same size as far as like width. Now height. Yeah, pretty similar. Pretty similar. Um, yeah. And as far as like the size of it on the side, they look pretty much the same here with Y. So great. This and this is a jumbo again, like I said. Um, looking at the look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? 
uh, the straps. Like this is gold. Um, now let me see. Now with my black, now I will say the difference is, now you see here, you look under there, this is the max. You're probably gonna get, this is gonna have to be worn. You cannot wear this. Can you wear this? Oh yeah, you actually can wear a crossbody. Um, yeah, so you can pull it through and wear a crossbody if you wanted to. Or you can wear it like this. It's your choice, okay? Um, same thing with here. Now, my, I have a, um, a little toilet kind of in here because it was just, I feel like the Chanel bag was just, the strap is so long. It's just too long for me, okay? And I'm tall. Now, this one, which, um, let me take this out here. You see here, this strap here, they are, you can make the Chanel is the same size, but really Chanel strap is that long. It's really long, which I think you don't need to strap them off. So this is a different, this is a shorter, this is a longer strap. And I actually have to put something in the purse to keep it shorter. Um, and then of course you can too change this into a crossbody as well. Um, which I don't feel like doing this one too. It can also be pulled through as a crossbody. But take it in mind that the strap on the Bajimishka is much shorter. It's half the size of a Chanel strap, okay? They both have these little gold uh, holes here where the strap goes to. It's two on each side. Um, now, this is a single flap bag. It's not a double flap. So I think single flap is more like this. So if this, if this is what you're looking for, a double flap type of look, this is going to work. This is single flap, so they're two on the side. So it's not going to be the same um, with my purse. But if you are, you have a double flap, it's going to be the same. They're going to look the same, okay? Um, the other difference in this one, this has a pocket where you can actually put a phone in it. it your hand doesn't go through it. This one, no pocket, as you can see. My hand goes all the way through like this, okay? Um, what else? Like I mentioned here. Oh, actually, I thought this was a magnetic closure snap, but really it's not. Actually, it's a turnkey like that. So you turn it, you open it to Chanel. And then, of course, you got the Chanel side. That's the difference. This one, because it's Bazzi Mishka, this is Bazzi Mishka. And you also turn it as well, and you open it, okay? Um, what else? Like I said before, there's no, there's a pocket here, which I love since you don't have the pocket on the back. This one, there's no pocket. Okay. Um, what else? Inside, you got a, actually a zipper here in the Chanel bag. Um, and this one, the zipper is in the middle of the bag. It's not on the side of the bag. And then you got the separation of the two. And this one, you don't see the separation. But, you know, so those are the differences. So I just feel like if you don't want to spend the exorbitant amounts, because I, when I got this, this is before the price increases or whatever, then you can get the exact, almost same look, okay, with this bag to And I'll try to leak this down below. But guys, this is a gorgeous, gorgeous bag, okay? So check it out. So if you like this type of content, guys, definitely subscribe to my channels. Person fanatic or fashion fanatic, depending on which one you're watching from. You like both and subscribe to both. Until I see you next time, take care, be healthy, and peace.